everyone, Daniela Borgiali here talking about alignment and posture in your tango. So a lot of times what happens is people put on heels for the first time, anything over one inch, and the body has to compensate for that. So your alignment and your posture is going to shift. Usually what happens is the pelvis comes forward, the knees bend, and you get this kyphosis, this curving of the upper spine. And then you show up in your tango world and you can't dance like this. So the teacher says, well, stick your butt out and stick your ribs forward. So then what we get is a little bit of this. We get a lot of forward tension, in which case the leader has to compensate for that. So can you walk me? And it looks okay and it functions, but I can tell you over time that my back will hurt. I'm getting no support from um, my abdominals. My ribs are coming forward, which means I'm shearing my spine, which means my vertebrae are doing this in order to do that. Over time, I will have pain. Also, if Stephen were to walk away, it limits me in terms of balance and in terms of how much movement I can do like this. So my suggestion is I'm going to put my pelvis and my ribs on top of each other as much as possible, and I'm going to grow really tall, and I'm going to project beyond Stephen. So if Stephen comes back, and I can imagine these two point, these my ribs softening and my pelvis relaxing so I can open up this space. Now we're gonna have a little bit of a different dance. I'm gonna grow tall up my spine as well. I'm still embracing, can you move now? So, something to play with. Have a great day, thank you Stephen.